Well, hello and welcome back. I think today, well, I could start working on designing up the new nest here, but I think I'm going to move on to the second one here for two and see how we go on the bridge too far. And of course, I like going with pervasive because it does allow me to for better long-term goals here. This fire okay, let's get these workers for miles gathering that food up here. Flight. Finally a landing at the sandy and ground deep in the swamp. The vantage point might good? seem like an ideal home, but it may be short-lived. This whole food, area food. is oh, liable yep. to flooding, and nearby rainfall is already causing the ground water to rise. We've got decent of food here as well. Exhausted and without her wings, the queen is unable to move on alone. But if she can amass enough daughters in time, the got colony as a whole may stand on. a chance. So I need a lot of fire ants here. So for the moment, we'll just spend this to keep expanding out. More. Because pervasive is good in the regard that it actually just allows me to not worry about having to food cost for hatching the fire ants. Cool. Oh, I can see them moving there, so that's not really great here, but this is giving me some more to work with. Can we just make our way up here? Up that way. Because I can't want to get as many... Of these as we can. So that's all the food there. So that's fine. We've got two of the nine. They're going to distribute food and start. Oh no, the eggs. Cool. Hopefully there's nothing up here they'd have to worry about. Cool. Nice amount of food there. I'm probably going to get a food store up and running. Many nearby creatures have already been washed out of their homes by the rising water. A lucky good? few have been deposited on the shores east of the nest. As I more done to the surface tensions yet. will rise, there isn't space here for everyone. That's why I'm trying to focus on building up my forces before I even start breaching the surface. Okay, we've got a decent amount with 11. I can get even more because that's a lot there. I think I definitely do need a food storage area. Let's see. That will do for food storage. Hopefully we don't breach into anywhere that would be untowards here. That. Alright, it's got everything here. Probably also go all the way over here with. No, we'll have speed tiles down here to allow easy access. I that all come around there. But for now, I need to get some more brews going. Okay. Once we've got like possibly a decent amount. Plus this food here and a bit more, we will head up to the surface and see what we can find up there. 23, 30, 24, 40. It's another one done. Probably have enough to be able to afford one more. That'll do. Okay. <clears throat> up to the surface, see what's up there. Whoa, okay, that was worrying. So we've got some food here. Yeah, gotta be careful with that dragonfly. A great blue skimmer, Libellula vibrans, hunts overhead. 
This fantastic aerial predator shouldn't cause any trouble for the ants. That is, unless it decides to land in their way. Yeah, that's a bit worrisome there. Oh, no, no, not that. Food is abundant, but as the flood water begins to rise, the ants will quickly lose access to the lower lands. So, we've got some food over there, so we'll get focus on that. Um, yeah, a bunch of creatures over here that I've got to be careful of. Expand out a little bit more here. The workers have done all they can to improve these food stores. Let's do this. And that. So that does leave me a little bit of room to be able to place a few more of them in, so that's fine. Cool. Um Creature attack. Seven, six, five, four. Oh, we're going to be attacked, aren't we? I'll get some more here. Hmm. The boggy earth at the base of the mound is now saturated, and as night approaches, the water begins to creep closer. The new arrivals will rush to higher ground, heading straight for the nest. Oh, that's right, we've also got aphids which we go. grab. Which we'll probably bring it over to somewhere else. Okay. Oh. Come on, attack. Okay, I've got enough here that I can actually easily overpower most everything here. So that'll provide me decent amounts of food, which I can use then use to expand my colony a bit more. An ant has fallen victim to a carnivorous plant. Nope. So I've got to think about how I'm going to deal with this here. Amongst the melee of panicking creatures are larvae of larvae of the false bombardier beetle. Can Already we... large and accomplished predators, they will hold their ground against small groups of ants. But that might be the case, but we don't have a small group of ants here. Um where do we have something? Can't get that yet. Okay. Fire attack them. No, no, don't go for that. Um, got small food over here. Some of this is not going to be easy to get to. We've got more food in, so that's good. Um, let's come back down and we'll breach into here. Should give me even more. So about a decent portion of the way through. Okay, false bombardier beetle. Not there are intruders in the nest. Yeah, I know. <clears throat> Not quite enough to be able to get to this one over here easily. But we've got some more food, so that's good. Um, no way over there. That's a long journey over there. The inundation has slowed, and fewer creatures are washing up to the east. The ants have an opportunity to explore for food, but there are other dangers at night. Moist-skinned amphibians have come out to take advantage of this That's new no good. water world, harvesting lost insects displaced from their burrows. Okay, let's give me a decent amount here. We can then also upgrade our food stores yet again. While we work. Okay, so all the food from here. 
It looks like it. That's going to give us a decent mount here. Okay. Probably use this to upgrade our food stores yet again. Cool. Which means we can upgrade that. <coughs> more of that down. Okay, that's dealt with. Over here. Can't quite get that lot over there. An ant has found itself entangled on the sticky tentacle of a dwarf sundew. As it tries to struggle free, more tentacles are drawn in, drowning the victim in thick mucilage. That's no good. Oh! Big old frog there. Okay, do we have access to these ones? This one over here? Yes. It's not too bad. Be careful of a few other spaces, so it's fine. Um, let's keep expanding our fire ants here. A brew tiles, so that's good. Grab what food we can from here. I might want to start thinking about transplanting aphids here. Not on food gathering, <coughs> transplanting to closer spot. Okay. Cool. As much as I can. Why is that? So low. Oh. A pine woods tree frog, Gila femoralis, has wandered into the trail. This one has taken a break from mate calling for a quick meal, and it seems that ants are on the menu. Oh, do I have enough to be able to overdo, outdo everything here? Come on, deal with it. Possibly. Oh, those are some nice spots, but that's only going to be open once the water level rises up a bit more. Okay, even more are coming, so we're in good position here. Okay, that's good. Um, that one down there first. That's... Oh, we could also get this one over here as well. So, not worry about food at the moment. I might need to get another group up, but we should have sufficient to be able to get this bridge over. And start transporting these aphids from this one over. There we go. Gather these few aphids from over here. How many are there? Eight. So that's fine. One more. Okay, that's it. Okay. Can we gather them from over here as well? Okay, that's all the ants over, so they're coming back. It's only a small bridge, but that'll allow me to get this part over there. I can't get that one yet. That's not too good spot. I could get this one over here. Okay. I have no idea where they're dumping them, but that's fine. Next up is this one over here. Okay, 
Because some of these I can't, don't have access to them yet. But the ones at the lower end, yeah. 40 seconds. No, I don't have time. Okay. So if that's the case, we need more resource rich areas to start gathering. We'll start gathering from the frog. An ant has fallen victim to a carnivorous plant. Okay, go for it. Got another one of the frogs over there. Yeah, this one will be for the next water level rise. I think this one's going to be out of the question because I don't have access to it yet. But, oh well. Yeah, the water level rose again, didn't it? Yep, can't, don't have access to that one, but I think I have access to this one over here. So stop gathering food. Actually, no, we need food. Continued rainfall is about to bring another torrent flushing through the bog, carrying with it a slew of ill-tempered arthropods. Um... Okay, so I need some workers to get going on here. Ah, uh, where's a good spot for some workers? See if right here. I just want another lot of workers to be fine. Because I want constant supply of food coming in, so it's good. No, I can't access this one over here yet. It's not high enough water level. I can access this one over here. So that's it. Get more. Okay, so that's done. So we can get some... workers down as well. Perfect. And then we'll set these workers to... gather from here. Perfect. So being careful about not going too far because yeah just gathering as many of the aphids as I can because that provides a nice decent constant supply of food for me Done. Can we get to this one over here? Not high enough water level. Not high enough water level for that one. Um, that one is still out. We need a bit higher water level there. Can't get that. But we do have access to this food down here. Cool. These guys constantly doing that. Let's go buy more food. We'll need to upgrade them when we can, but it's fine. Let's get another one of these guys down. Oh, you guys are in a good spot here. Do all that. Anything else I can do? No. Okay, it's good. Come back up here. We need to spread it in the nest. The larvae must be protected. I think it might be really smart to get another separate one to have for internal usage here. That's dealt with. Okay. So. Gonna get some more brood here. Um, we can also use this time to go expand out and has fallen victim to a carnivorous plant. Yeah, it's fine. Got plenty of food coming in. Um, so if these guys come over here, we'll start heading over this way because there could be some good stuff over here as well. Oh, I've got plenty of food. Nice. There we go. 
It's a decent amount of food coming in there as well. There we go, it's going to give me a decent amount here once more. Um... Got no water level rising yet. Got a nice amount of aphids here, check. Oh, my full food source full? Cool. Keep that going. Just a mess of here. Can we get to... No, that still needs to be a bit higher up. Um, it's going to be next old few more war levels rising. The ants will fight to the death. Okay. Well, come back. We need we need you all back up here. To defend. Okay, you guys will be three. You'll be internal defense force, so that's fine. And let's hold off on that for now. Okay. With nowhere to drain, the floodwater creeps ever nearer to the nest. Already cramped and irritated, a panic ensues, and the refugees scramble for higher ground. Yep. You do that. And we'll defend. The ants must defend themselves. That's what I'm doing. Bring these here again, keep an eye on the water rising. Because next level is going to provide access to some decent amount of foods as well. Uh, 10 seconds. I think it's going to act, give me access to this one over here. That's why I think it's going to give me access to the milk, that milkweed there. I was too slow to get to that one. Actually, this gives me access over here. Via three bridges, so... Cancel that, we need more... Fire ants over here. Um, maybe I need a... Bit more from this lot over here. Hopefully I have enough to be able to get to that milkweed. Oh, that actually gives me access to this ant colony over here as well. That's got a lot as well. Hmm. There we go. Got that. Yeah, it took most of my ants to get that one there. Now we're almost halfway there, so I think we're pretty good. Get that food here. This going. If we have enough news of the insect feast has spread across the swamp. With growing numbers of amphibians patrolling the waters, the Invictors scavenging expeditions will need to be well defended. 
We got plenty here. Oh, we got a lizard coming up. That's no good. I'll keep this going. A colony of little black ants marooned on a smaller section of the mound may be reachable if the fire ants join together to bridge the gap. Okay, now that's going to be a good supply of food here, so. Let's go for it. We've got 73 on my attack force here, so it's going to be good. Um, internals? Nice. Yes. If you can kind of get... That's going to have to wait till the next water rise, before and I can get that one. New hmm. The newt Notofalmus viridations is devouring ants. Growing up to 10 centimeters in length, it dwarfs other creatures on the mound. Don't its hear. red skin is toxic and serves as a warning to potential predators. That's no good. Oh, go take it down. Okay. Uh, internal, I think we might have enough here, but if we. Expand this way a touch more, we might be able to get some more going on here, which is what I'm after. Okay. Let's go after this here. Oh, there's another one making its way up. I want to raid this nest before anything untowards happens here. <clears throat> the ants will fight to the death. Yep. Cool, that's exactly after. Yeah, we probably just about outnumber them severely. Where's their queen? Right here! Wow, that is actually very close. I don't have much food, so this is actually a pretty good spot for me to be able to... ...attack. I might need a larger arm before I can go after them. Or, we don't go into the nest, we go for their aphids. Okay, no, let's not worry about this at the moment, it's just too much. Okay. Let's get internal stuff dealt with first. There's a bit of food over here. Some more food down there, some more food around, yep. Workers still need to get a few more going for that. Okay, let's just have them join forces for now. Must fight. Go. The oh. colony is starving. There is not enough food to feed the new brood. I know that, but there is a lot of food right here. Hopefully, there's enough working on this there. <coughs> I can keep these aphids going here. 73, so about 90. <sighs> Need to get almost double the amount. Okay. 
Good. The ants must defend themselves. Yeah, it's just cheap to get more than the quality ones. It's quantity of quality, because I need a lot. Because to even get to the point where I get double the much, I need to spend three times as much to get two per. So it's much easier to just go for more here. Actually, let's cancel that. Perfect. Okay, what was rise risen again? That's probably going to give me access to this lot here. You guys stay out. Um, that's the one that would level away. Do we have access to these guys yet? Okay, we've lost access from over there, so that's fine. As the water draws ever nearer, oh, more insects like a decent amount begin there to here. wash up on the cool. bank. The Invicta colony must maintain control or risk being overrun. That's what I'm trying to do here. Um, some spots are not worth to get food. Oh, there's a bit of water food for me here. But that's going to be a decent amount of food over here we have access to now. But first off, my main goal is that. Okay. Now, out of the way. Need all this food here. Check. We're barely keeping up with the amount of aphids we've got going on there, so that's fine. There um, are so intruders in the nest. That's what this was for. To deal with them. Got enough of that it's actually worth it to do that. Cool. Gonna get some more food coming in. Pretty decent amount of food up there as well. Do we have access to this yet? No, that's a massive bridge I'm going to need for that one. Okay. Anywhere else? No, that's fine. It's going to be a little bit before I can go back over to them, but hopefully by that time I'll have a much larger army that I can work with here. Okay. An ant has fallen victim to a carnivorous plant. Yeah, I know that happens. We finish over there. Let's go up here. <coughs> oh, more, f more of that. Okay. Now we're getting there. Okay, that's dealt with. We've got it's all one big colony, one group, so that's good. Go long before we can get that one. A bit before we can get that one. That's a huge note. Okay. So. We'll make our way back over here. Get that going. Food's still being consistently harvested, so that's good. Get 
Okay. Let's see what we have over here. And come on. Oh, a couple of frogs. Okay. The ants must defend themselves. But that's like 600 food over there, so that's going to be a nice amount for me to gather here. Cool. Yeah, just a massive fire ant brood. Expanding as much as we can. Yes, it's all been harvested there. Cool. So it looks like, yep, yeah, we've got the creature set coming. Okay, that's another entry point there, so that's fine. But we need to bring out all our ants up here. Oh, food stores are full. that going. I almost reached the critical mass here. Yep, just let them come at me because, well, this is going to be fairly easy to deal with. Again, the floodwaters rise. The washed up invertebrates panic and a stampede ensues. The Invicta soldiers must form ranks quickly. I knew it was coming, so that's why we sent all our soldiers out here to, well, deal with it all. It's actually going to provide a decent amount of food for me as well. Okay, water rising again soon, so that's fun. The colony is starving. There's not enough food to feed the new brood. Okay, I need more workers to help out here. That's no use doing it over there. Where's another good spot? Got so much brood that. Now you guys are up here. Focus on that there. That's good. That's all done. Get a bit of food from here. Four levels right, risen again, which gives access to this lot over there, which is going to be a bit of a long shot. And also gives me access to the black ant colony, perfect. Cool. Wait, we've almost got the population necessary for this. Good to see. Do we have enough? Gonna need, need another couple of bridges, so that's fine. Okay, we've got enough here, so that should Transport the rest of them over. That's our next goal. To deal with them.
the ants must defend themselves. That's on the way, so... It's pretty decent here. The Monomorium Black Ant Colony is soon to be flooded. This is the Fire Ant's last chance to raid their nest. Which is what I'm going to do now. Okay. Oh! Got the dragonflies there. Do we have enough? Because that's... Okay, we've got the ants. We can gather them at the top of the hill if need be. I want even just a few more before we do this. Okay, go for the queen. Cool. I probably went too far with too many. I've got a consistent flow going on here. Yeah, they're running out, so that's good. The colony is starving. There's not enough food to feed the new brood. Okay, the very top of the hill. Oh, that frog just got in the way. <clears throat> Nuisance. Yep, and they got some more food. Just a little bit more, but... It's fine. Get some that upgrade. As if the colony didn't already have enough to deal with, the Great Blue Skimmer has chosen this moment to touch down right outside the nest. It's no Unchecked, good. Unchecked, this titan of the sky will no doubt disrupt colony activities. But if the soldiers are able to bring her down, the rewards could be mighty. Yep. Now we're getting there. It's just it takes so long to get anywhere here. Oh, and then this frog just going the way. Oh, that. After a sustained assault from the fire ants, the skimmer's stamina is beginning to wane. She leaps away from battle and prepares to take off. If the ants want to prevent her escape, they'll need to act quickly. Go, 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 go. Ah, but there's other creatures in the way. Okay, there we go. Her wings weighted down with fire ants. The skimmer no longer has the strength to take off. Cool, deal with all that. We've got plenty of ants here. There we go, the skimmer's going down. Yeah, I no longer had the chance to get after the black ants, but oh, it's fine. We've got 123. Okay, it's 500. Food. By relentless stings, the great skimmer's attempts to flee became ever more futile. Finally collapsing atop the mound, she succumbs to the fire ants. Dismemberment will follow. Go. Cool. And quickly taking it down, and... See, can we wait till we get the full brood here? Possibly. Okay, 
Go deal with these frogs. Cool. Frogs being dealt with. Ah, let's just get this done. Yep, we've got enough. Everyone, we're going. We have enough to get this one done here. No food, just get at the top. By joining their bodies together to form a giant raft, the fire ants were able to ferry the queen from the mound just as the nest filled with water. Their perils are not over, but they've shown great resilience and an ability to survive in this harsh hey, we environment. Did it. Wherever they land, the creatures of the swamp will quickly come to know the might of the fire ants. Cool. I think this point... More territory would be a good one. And we did it. We survived that flood. That's good. Why is there a pile of substrate in the middle of the workspace? It's the ventilation terrible down here. The stuff builds up in the corners. <laughs> uh, I'd put in a complaint. If you're up to something, I will find out. Oh, up to something? All I do is try to make the place a little bit tidier. I clean the desks and suddenly I'm up to something. Oh, that's very nice, very rich. Up to something. I'm not up to anything. My raptors, on the other hand. <laughs> okay, so, yeah. I'll worry about upgrading the nest next time. Because I still need to figure out what I'm going to do here, because we've got a lot of area, but it's going to take a while to get this set up. So, we got the Mission 4 2 done. And I might as well, at this point actually go in and unlock the fire ant pervasive I like got the pervasive get this leveled all the way up to level three and just increase my amount on enemy let's go sure evasive yeah and the other one we've got last stand Let's grab Last Laugh could be a good one. We've got 344, so it means we could start upgrading a few of these, but I think that's good here because it's going to be... How far can you actually take this? Okay, that is interesting. Definitely is interesting, so piercing, uh, yeah. But now, I'll call it the end here. So that, I'm gonna say thank you all for watching. If you like what you see, then you can always comment, like, and subscribe down below. And if you want to, you can also come join me over my Discord or my Twitch. I stream every day over twitch.tv slash xbox12 every Monday through Friday. And that, thank you all again for watching. Have a wonderful day, and it's xbox12 saying, see ya.